Thank you, Erica. We have this developing story out of Berkeley where around three this morning, a fire breaking out at Chez Panisse on the 1500 block of Shattuck Avenue. Crown Force Will Trend live with a more on the scene of this famous restaurant catching on fire this morning. Well, well, Mark, investigators are still on the scene. They just gave a tour to a world famous chef here, Alice Waters, who's out here very emotional talking to us about uh, what, what this means to her and the damage that she saw. So let's join in on the news conference. Complete support of the insurance companies. Everybody will. So best case scenario for people who love your restaurant, what do you think in terms of when it could reopen? Well, uh, I don't know about downstairs, and um, it's just a matter of us rebuilding the hallway to the upstairs, but I can see that the upstairs could open very soon if we find some way to, to you know, camouflage the front of the building and figure out. I think we'll have to put up one of those, those big screens that has a picture of what the restaurant looked like <laughs> like they do in Italy when they're doing reconstruction. <laughs> will you build it to be exactly the same or will you well, change it? I don't know. The first uh, thought I had was maybe we should extend the dining room out further. You know, maybe we should make it a little larger because it's always been so small. I don't know whether we can do that, but that's a, that was a first thought I had. As you were taking the tour, your thoughts relieved, devastated. I mean, it looks like the damage is on the outside and not the inside. Can you just walk us through, walk us through your emotions? At well, that time? I mean, I'm uh, I'm pretty shaky right now, but I'm I'm uh, I'm just glad no one was in the building. It's really amazing. I mean. Uh, to have something like this happen if it's an electrical fire and people were there. I mean, it's very small building. Uh, it has a lot of people in it. Uh, uh, there could have been, you know, as many as 200 people in the building at any one time. And so I, I, that's a great relief that, that in the middle of the night that this happened. and. Uh, I'm, I, uh, you know, it really focuses all your attention on what's important. <laughs> and uh, it's kind of like, uh, I guess I have to pay attention to my home right now. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And we'll just show you the damage over here. The firefighters are still securing the scene. The damage is on the outside. They believe that's where it started. Pretty much underneath the floor, it reached up. Minimal damage on the inside, but you just heard world famous. I mean, she's cooked for presidents. There's, she's done so much for Berkeley. She's the star of celebrity chefs. Uh, she said that she doesn't know when this place will reopen. It'll be up to the fire department to secure it, to let her know. But it looks like it will be some time. But uh, good news, if you're a huge fan of Alice Waters and a huge fan of this restaurant, it is not destroyed. They can rebuild. Back to you, Mark. Yeah, good news there. Yeah, they uh, pioneer California cuisine. Chez Panisse consistently ranked as one of the top 50 restaurants in the world.